Hi folks, uh, we're looking at Bruce Metzer, uh, one of the great textual critics who has not long been dead, and he wrote a book uh, on the New Testament canon. In that book he traces the early church fathers, how they used um, the uh, New Testament, how they saw it as authoritative. He looks at uh, the persecution of the church and recognises that the church needed to have a definition of which books were worth dying for. Uh, he talks about the Gnostics and expounds who the Gnostics were, why the Gnostics uh, said what they said, and how that relates to the New Testament. And um, Metz's work is uh, thoroughly researched, and basically his, his thesis is that there was a clear understanding of what books were authoritative the problems and difficulties of trying to piece the whole historical situation of the formation of the canon is due to the fact that in the time of the early church there were difficulties in communication in terms of which part of the church knew what the other part of the church was doing and so we have that's why we have debates about um, whether revelation was in the canon or whether to peter was in the canon um, but this is a very informative work, a very standard work that if you're going to talk about textual criticism that you need to read uh, and a very powerful uh, tonic against people like Bart Ehrman who studied under Bruce Metzer and Bert, uh, Bart Ehrman criticises the New Testament concerning its textual veracity. But Bruce Metzer would be for the, uh, the uh, textual veracity of the New Testament. So it's a work that's well worth reading, uh, you won't agree with everything, I don't agree with everything, but it's a very, very good book. Take care.